Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll show you how to install Docker container in Red Hat Linux 8.2 operating system. So I have base operating system in my laptop. It is Windows 10 and I have installed VMware Workstation 16 Pro in my base operating system Windows 10. This is my laptop. So on top of that VMware Workstation, I have installed Red Hat 8.2 OS with the VMware workstation so I have installed with the Red Hat image so I have booted my image with Red Hat 8.2 and top of that I need to install docker container so let's uh, achieve this how to install docker container in my Red Hat 8.2 operating system so for this you need a VMware workstation or any other 64-bit uh, or 32-bit based upon your operating system in the base and you need to install it and you need to have an a operating system on top of that what was the operating system you need to go with it and let me log into my operating system Linux so this is my Linux box which I have installed in the VMware so let me switch to root so here it is follows like we need to before while installing we need to check all the uh, docker commands on docker packages so with this you can remove docker if it is already existing or it is failed like uh, some other installation commands has been dropped and uh, you need to hit enter so it will remove all the packages which are pre-installed or uh, already it is installed in your uh, operating system so hit enter so it is saying that no match for argument docker no match for docker client so there is no packages to be removed as of now so the next thing is you need to check your m repo list and before m repo list you need to clean all your repos so it is saying that 19 files has been removed so copy m repo list and it will fetch whatever the repos you are having appstream and base os i have right now i have two repos in my operating system and next you need to install docker so m install hyphen m utilities is a package it will install config manager the package so you need to copy this so it will install m config manager from this utilities package so it is installed it is already been installed so it is saying that nothing to do and you need to copy this repo and it will so before that I'll show you how to check your repos so if you see here I have only local repo and red hat repo if I copy paste this command it is going to config manager my adding repo in this directory and it will fetch from the package with this URL so if you hit enter so it is saying that adding repo from HTTPS so this is where you can get your add your repo into this location so next thing is to install the docker in my operating system so copy this command and install your docker latest package or latest container in your operating system so it is going to fetch from the HTTPS docker download center is docker repos wait a second sorry guys for that comment I have given the wrong command instead of center is I have given RHL repo so copy this command and paste it so it is added and you need to m clean all m repo list so if you see here docker c hyphen stable repo has been added so let's try to install the docker container in my operating system so copy this command so it will install the latest packages of the docker container so you need to click on Y so 
if you see here in the installing page packages architecture x 64 and versions repositories it has been fetching from this so this is where it will take some time to install all these packages let us wait for the installation of completion So the docker installation has been done. So try to create service docker status. So defaultly the docker container will be in an active state. It is in dead state. So to start and enable the docker use this command systemctl enable alpha alpha now docker. So with this command it will automatically enable and it will start the service. So Try to check the status so before you have checked that it is in dead state but it now it is in active and running so this is where how the installation will work and try to check if my docker is installed or not docker images so if you see here there is no docker images and it is saying that docker is installed and you don't have any docker images so this is where you can install red hat on top of Red Hat operating system with the Docker container in the VMware itself. So this is where how it helps. I will make a video of how to install operating system on VMware and I will boot the OS with the Red Hat 8.2. So I will make a video on that. So that's it guys.